in our previous video we have learned how to generate any of the spec logs in the console using the jasmine spec reporter today we are going to learn how to generate the report in terms of html report for that i am going to use the allure report but other than that we have plenty of reports for the protector let us see what are those so first we have this protector beautiful reporter by sauce lab and that's look good but still i think allure has the great look and feel we have this html reporter but the look and feel is not great and also similarly we have this an another html reporter and you can see right so this also doesn't doesn't look really great and this one is unmaintained so of course we are not going to touch this so the best choice will be the allure report because it supports the sequential as well as the parallel execution uh, the combined report as well so we are going to stick to this allure report let us see how to use this in our script and it's going to be very very easy nothing like uh, extend report we have to write so many codes just we have to install the plugin and then we have to use it that's it so first of all of course we have to add the dependency i'm just going to copy this and if i go back to my terminal and let us paste this dependency and it's going to take few seconds and also make sure that we are going to install the dependency with dash g so that it's going to be available in our global environment as well that's it so we are done with the dependency now we have to add the function whatever provided by the allure for example you can see that within this config file con.js within the onprepare function we have to just copy this and paste over there so i'm just going to copy this and of course we need this as well spec reporter so we can check in the console and of course we want the html report as well and here we can see that it is the result directory so by default in my project level it is going to create a folder as allure results and then it is going to give us some xml file and based on that we are going to generate the html file let us see how to do that so if i go back to my terminal and let me clear this and here we are within our learn reports folder where we have this report conf.js within that only we are doing all the changes and within this report config we have this input spec which is going to be our this particular five specs and one is disabled you can see that right so let us try to run this now so of course first i have to get into the folder so i will say learn reports and then after that i have to call protector then followed by reports conf So here you can see that our test case has run successfully, four specs executed successfully and one got uh, disabled because of course we have used that XID. Now if I go back to my project and here we can see that within the learned reports folder itself, we are able to get this folder as Allure result. If you want this in your parent or the root of your project, you can just add dot slash here and that's going to do that job for us. Now here I'm going to open this in Explorer and you can see that within this folder we are able to get one xml file but of course i want this to be in the format of html so for that we have to use another dependency that is going to be our allure command line tool now if you go to this just search allure command line tool and go to your npm and then of course we have to add the dependency so i'm just going to copy this and open your command prompt and just paste over here and also make sure that we are going to paste this as dash g or else you will get some error like this right so here you can say that it says it says no such directory so of course we have to use this dash g that means it's going to add the dependency in the global in our npm folder now here you can see that it says that one updated one package i have already this so it says updated in your case it's going to be like added one or some packages right now then you have to close this and go back to the folder and go back to your parent folder wherever this 
allure hyphen result folder is there in that place you have to open your command prompt and then type allure then followed by serve now this command prompt is going to act like your server and here in this and using that you can see we are able to get this local host and then followed by we are able to get the reports now if i click on this here you can see that interact with inputs the, by default the order is not maintained here so we can click on this order and here you can see that enter the first name into the up in the tab and get the value clear me and this is basically skipped so we are able to get this and here also you can see the status of like how many failures how many pass and how many skip or if there is any um unknown status we will get all this information so this looks good in the next video we will also discuss how to add the screenshot in our reporter thanks for watching see you in the next one very soon